Hey everyone and welcome to day 23 of our Command 66 Day Challenge. Today we're going to talk about the chat resources um, that are on the bottom right of your command page. So I know we have already <clears throat> spent some time talking about the lab dog in the bottom right corner that you're able to click on and submit ideas. So what I wanted to talk about today was the chat feature as well as the support feature. So if you click on the support button, um, it uses a support bot to recommend suggestions of um, help articles based on maybe where you're at in command. Um, and you can also type in questions that um, will help it know maybe what you're looking for to send related support articles. So sometimes this might be helpful to answer whatever question you have without actually having to have a conversation with support. If it doesn't, then instead of calling support and sitting on hold for a long time, you actually have this option here to click get in touch. And it will come up with two ways to get in touch. You can leave a message or you can do a live chat. I have done the live chat numerous times um, and it is super easy to get, um, get in a conversation with someone. It lets you know how many people are in the queue in front of you. Um, and I have not had to wait nearly as long as I previously had to wait um, on hold on a phone. Um, and so it's a really great resource to have. So what you can do is click on live chat and you'll put in your information here. So your name, um, your contact number and your message, and then you'll click start chatting and um, you'll be able, or you'll be connected with um, somebody on the support team that will be able to help guide you through what, whatever you're trying to figure out. So I know a lot of times you might be working on command in the evenings or on the weekends when um, we're not here at the office to provide assistance. So this is a, an amazing resource to <clears throat> take advantage of. And if they um, need you to attach a screenshot of something, you're able to do that in the chat so that that can provide clarity about exactly what issue you might be having in command. And they'll be able to let you know if that's something that um, is a known issue or if there's a way that you can resolve it and how to do that. Um, and they also should follow up with you um, if you've, you have communicated with them about a known issue to let you know that it has been resolved. If you minimize that, we actually also have this chat option here. So this command chat will allow you to um, communicate like quickly with someone in your referral network by sending them a message, or um, you can, if you're a part of a team, you'll be able to click this team one and choose anyone on your team to send a chat to in here. So they'll be, if they're working in command, they'll have that chat and they can quickly respond to you. It'll also show your recent conversations. And you have an Ask Kelly button here that you can click on. So you can type a message here to ask Kelly something. And if you want to click this pencil icon here, that's how you'll start a new conversation. So you can just search anyone's name. So that's in the Keller Williams um, database. So if I wanted to search Julie, since I don't have her on here, um, there you'll see her picture come up and her name and so I'll click on that and I'll click save and then I'll type a message to her. So and I'll send that to her. And so she'll be able to respond to me from command and I'll be able to access this recent conversation in here. So I can close that out there. So this is a great way to communicate with people in our office or in other Keller Williams offices. And my understanding is this will soon integrate with the Kelly app as well so that you can be notified through the app um, if you're not sitting down in front of command um, to receive that message. So um, I would love you guys to test that out. So maybe go in there and um, add me and send me a message in command so that I can get that chat from you. So that's all for day 23 of our command challenge. Thanks for watching.